Hi, and this is my video on how to eat a dragon fruit. And to do this, and you can actually do this just with your hands. The first time I ate dragon fruit, I didn't know how to eat one. I think I've, um, actually the first time I ate, I, or, or sorry, I, um, the first time I ate a dragon fruit on my own, like, I bought one in the store, took it home, and said, how the heck do I eat this? So I, um, a few um, months before, I had um, dragon fruit in a fruit in a hotel buffet, and it was delicious. And so I decided to get, get one. And, and this is kind of the um, a perfect fruit. Um, it has a whole bunch of seeds, but they're small. They're kind of like sesame seeds, but smaller. And so they, um, they add texture to the fruit. Um, and they're just delicious, like um, like the dragon fruit. So there's no uh, there, there's no like giant seed in the middle of this, like there is in some other fruits. There's just like inside of this is just fruit. And um, actually, nobody has showed me how to eat this, so I just kind of figured it out on my own. Um, when I did it the first time, I just started peeling these things off, and then eventually, um, eventually you peel this off. But basically, there's a fruit inside. And um, and then you eat the fruit inside, and uh, that's that's how it goes. So, what? Um, um, so, so so I I really like fruit that you can just like eat, and there's not like a whole bunch of preparation to it. And then dragon fruit is that, and it's delicious. So uh, there's it's pretty much the perfect fruit. So um, to eat a dragon fruit, uh, this is what I recommend. Even though you can just like. Um, tear off the peel and start eating into it. I recommend a dragon fruit, a knife, and um, I, um, I have a cutting I have a cutting board, and then plenty of um, paper towels. So I'm I'm anticipating that I'm going to drip all over myself. So I'm going to put a paper towel down here, and oh, and I'll um, get some get some extra oops spare paper towels um, just in case. So. Um, so, so what, um, basically this is where the dragon fruit attaches to the, um, dragon fruit plant, whatever that looks like. And then this is the flower. So, uh, there's a, uh, there's a somewhat hard stem right here. So, oh, oh, so, so you want to cut it, uh, make, make the first cut right here. And if you're really good, you can have um, take all of this off in just one fell swoop, and I'm not really good, so I think um, ho um, hopefully I'll be able to cut it in like uh, or like two peels. You know, you know, like um, it's kind of like peeling an orange. Like if you're really good at peeling an orange, and if the and if the skin's pretty loose. Oh, and and uh, this is something that I that I that I thought about trying the last time I ate one of these things is kind of like squeezing it like this, so that um, because. Um, sometimes some of the fruits um, is on the stem, so so this works with oranges. Hopefully, it doesn't like bruise my um, dragon fruit because I've ne I've never actually done this before. Um, okay, so hopefully this will help. Ho hopefully that will help it to peel a little bit easier. So um, so anyway, in, um, inside is inside is white and w uh, with with black seeds, and sometimes I think they're red so 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 this is the this is the first one or this is the first um, peel taking off and then I'm gonna try and take off the uh, um, the rest of it in one thing without dropping it and and was showing you all at the same time too and I um, so my uh, my whole thing about like massage massaging the outside of it didn't actually work. Because it is Oh, and actually I got that totally backwards. I should have um, I should have hit I, I should have done the other side of it first. So now uh, now this is the inside of the the dragon fruit, and you can eat it like an apple, except for there, there's no core. 
um, you can, and I'll I'll actually do this first, you, um, which uh, which I should do on here, but I don't have enough hands to actually do that. So so you can uh, you can slice it off, and oh. Okay, so that um, that fell on the floor. I, I I really wanted to eat the whole dragon fruit, but I don't think I should eat the dragon fruit that fell on the floor. At least not in the video. So so you can slice them like this, or um, slice them into um, half halves of like this, and then eat them. And like I said, they're really delicious. They're really um, they're pretty sweet, and a little bit um, a little bit sour, but not too sour, and. I'm really not good at um, describing how food tastes like, so I'm not that kind of a food critic. But this one's kind of like moderately sweet. Some are some are really sweet. This, uh, but but they're all really really good. And then um, I think it's a lot easier and better just to eat it like an apple. Oh, it, and the nice thing about this is it drips. Like like if you were eating an orange like this, but it's much much less sticky than an orange, so um, so so that's really nice. Um, obviously, I'm going to wash my hands after after this, but like as soon as I'm done with an orange, then that's the first thing I always do is wash my hands, and I guess that's the first thing I always do when I'm done eating a dragon fruit, um, especially with it's dripping like it's dripping on me like this. But um, but but basically now um, I can like just take a bite of the dragon fruit. And like I said, um, usually the way people do this is they slice it into a whole bunch of little slices, share it with two or three people. Um, but if you really like dragon fruit, you can do what I'm doing and just eat the whole thing like this. And actually my worst fear in making this video is because this is pretty slippery to eat like this. Um, so generally, it's a lot better if you have a plate or something underneath instead of just paper towels. Um, so, so I'm really worried that I'm it's going to drop on the floor, and then I'm going to be sad for the rest of the video. Oh, and then the the price of this, I think, um, be, um, because I got I got a lot of I got a lot of fruit with this, but I think they're about thirty baht each, which is, which is about a dollar each, um, and I think um, the weight is probably about like forty percent peel weight, and then sixty percent fruit weight, so you're paying for a lot of peel, but it's it's a really delicious fruit. Yeah, and I actually can't remember because I think I think apples are pretty expensive here because they're all imported, and then dragon fruit is grown in Thailand. So I think um, I can't remember if it was one for thirty baht, which is about a dollar each, or if it's two for thirty baht. I can't remember. And then generally the stores, um, like the nice, the high-end grocery stores, will sell these um, by um, by the um, um, by by each as they call them Luke. Um, like um, Luke, Luke just means ball, which is like a classifier. But um, but they say uh, they 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 sell these um, in each as, which is always more expensive. And then the the place on the side of the street that sells fruit, um, that's where I got this one. Um, I think they usually sell them by um, by by um, kilo or um, ki ki kilogram. Um, so they sell them by kilogram. Um, but the lady that I bought these from was basically like, oh, well, it's this this many kilograms. So uh, I don't think she even weighed um, this, even though her sign said it was by kilogram.
And I can't remember if I said this, but this is actually the second video that I tried like this. Um, where, where I ate a dragon fruit on video, but my sound was really bad last time, so hopefully the sound is okay on on this because like um, something or my my sound amplifier is kind of broken now like um, it used to not be so broken but now it's pretty broken and um, but um, like like half of the outputs are broken now And then that, that, that's the last of the dragon fruit. I, my arm is all drippy. My paper towel is all um, wet. Um, this is the uh, this is the peel that I got off in two um, two parts. I um, uh, um, see see how some of the dragon fruit still in this still inside. So that's what I was uh, that's what I was trying to avoid, and. What I what, what I should have done because this uh, this part right here is hard. I I meant to cut or what what um, I meant well. Um, it's not this side that I should have cut. I should have cut this side um, because this is the like hard um, part by the stem, not by the not by where it connects to the tree that I should have cut to. So I'll know, I'll know that better in the future, and hopefully you enjoyed my dragon fruit video on how to eat dragon fruit and. Certainly, you can do it more classily than I did, but um, that's not me. So anyway, um, thanks very much.